All right, today I have the iHealth Nexus wireless body composition scale that I'm going to be unboxing. It says that it's an elegant design made possible through ITO coding. I don't know who ITO is, but she sounds nice. All right, so I got this right here. Uh, it has nine essential body composition metrics, which is important uh, for some things that I'm looking for. They have uh, body fat percentage as well as BMI body mass index for those of you who are wondering what it is but also it also detects your hydration it's very important for those of you who work out a lot and need to stay hydrated it has a bluetooth low energy sync and it has smart recognition up to eight users okay and advanced ito coding surface again i don't know who she is never met her i'm going to go ahead and get to opening this but before you can see right here, it shows that it is going to detect the weight, body water, muscle mass, body fat percentage, lean mass, bone mass, BMI, which is body mass index, very important, vascular fat rating, and daily calorie in intake, DCI. So it has all of this, you know, with the app that you, that you can uh, get with this. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and open this up from the bottom now we're here. Go ahead. And here it is. Look at it. That's a, actually, that's not the scale. This is a piece of cardboard. You can use this for serving, what do you call it, charcuterie board, cartuterie, cartuterie, charcuterie. Anyway, you could use this. This would be a great plate for that. All right, so here it is in all its glory right here. Going to pull this out. Here are batteries that come with it. Let's see what it looks like. And inside are the batteries. There are four. I believe that's four. Let me see. One. It's four batteries. Okay, so it has four batteries. They're wrapped in looks like saran wrap or some sort of plastic wrap. I'm just going to go ahead and take that off using my scissors. So it has four AAA batteries. I'm going to pull it out this coating thing that they were talking about. It says health right here, eye health. And on the bottom, it has the batteries where you put the batteries in. I'm gonna go ahead and put those in. I'm gonna go ahead and pull that back. And then put the batteries in just like this. Unos. Quatro, dos, tres. All right. So I have the batteries in, line them up, and then I am going to go ahead and put the cap back on. Let's see what it shows right here. Nothing happened. Well, that's because I have to stand on it. Now, I'm about to stand on my business. Uh, first, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. The brief instructions right here. I'm going to go over this. Not going to go into too much detail. It says, one, put the batteries in. Two, download the iHealth My Vitals app. Okay. So, you can do that through the Apple Store. Let me get in closer so you can see this. It says, uh, so after you install the batteries like I did, uh, you're going to install the iHealth My Vitals app from the Apple Store or the Google Play. Follow the on-screen instructions to register and set up your iHealth. So I'm going to do that. And then three, add device to this. Please make sure your phone's Bluetooth is enabled. I'm going to go ahead and do that and uh, get back with, with you in a second. All right, so let's go ahead and do this. So once you've downloaded the app, you're going to 
come up to this screen right here once you open up the app where you enter your password and your email. Excuse me, I said that wrong. Enter your email and password, confirm, and then you agree to iHealth My Vitals mailing list. Oh, you don't have to agree to that, uh, but you have to agree to the terms and conditions and privacy policy. Uh, once you've done that, you're going to enter your gender and then when you were born. Okay. And after you've done that, you've created an account. It says create an account. And then you go down here and press get started. Okay. It will also ask you something to enable notification permissions. Get the latest version of the app in a timely manner. Enjoy time, enjoy limited time benefits such as etc. iHealth will not disturb you. Okay. All right, it says right here, do not show again. If you have option, you can select do not show again if you want to. Go ahead and do that and then open immediately to get started. Here we go. Let's go ahead and do this. It says iHealth would like to send you notifications. Notifications may include alerts, sounds, icon badges. These can be configured in settings. Allow. It says, would you like to link your iHealth account to Apple Health Kit? Permission will be granted only for this account. You have the option of doing no or yes. I'm going to do yes. And then it takes me down here. It says, it has all of these right here. And I'm going to go ahead and select turn on all. And then I'm going to allow. And then voila. And then it says select new device. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually press this. And then I'm going to go to scales because that's what I'm going to be doing, a scale. So I'm going to go scales and then I have the Nexus. Okay, I have the Fit Nexus, not the Pro, but the Fit Nexus. So that's the second one down. It also has other options for different scales that you can choose from. So I'm going to do that. It says iHealth would like to use Bluetooth. iHealth needs Bluetooth in order to connect devices. I'm going to go ahead and allow and install batteries. I did that. I'm going to go ahead and press next. And then it's going to ask me my height and weight. And you go ahead and enter that in. And press OK. It says install batteries. Did that. Next. It says not working. Select device to connect. And it pops up on the screen right here. Select the device to connect. And I'm going to go ahead and do that. And it says connecting. And it says the device is connected. Stand on scale with bare feet. And I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to stand on the scale with my bare feet. And right away, it's showing the weight right there. And it seems like it's doing some other calculation and it gives you other things such as uh, all that you need to see right here. Pretty cool.